This is Brother Thomas Stafford coming to you live from the pond behind, bring you God word and Acts the, the, the book of Acts, the prophet. I'm going to read you the eighth chapter of the prophet. I said, but you, uh, you, but you shall receive power when the Holy Spirit come upon you and you shall be witness to me in Jerusalem. That means God gave, gave, told his disciples to go to a place called the upper room and to wait on the Holy Spirit. When the Holy Spirit comes, that means God will give you all of and all kinds of tongues. And they went and they were filled with the Holy Spirit and began to speak with another tongue. And the Holy and the Spirit gave them all of That means when God give you on the word, the Holy Spirit come to you and you start speaking a different tongue. That means the devil don't know what you're talking about and nobody else but God. So that means you're talking in honor. Thank you, Jesus. Like today, I stay at church. I'm glad, because one, I'm glad the pastor called me. I'm glad I'm walking with God. I'm, I'm walking with God piece by piece. But as God know, I'm trying. So all y'all people out there that going through, always keep your head up. Never come off, like Brother Joe was saying, Never come off your wall. If you build your wall for God, keep on building your wall. And don't let the devil bring you down. Don't let nobody bring you the army. Keep your heads up. Like Joe, like Brother Joe was saying, the tongue is a powerful thing. They can cut you, they can help you, or they can hurt you. So basically, the Bible says, do not touch the anointed one. And do my prophet no harm. And when they, when the day of pillar come, they will came. Oh, no. They appeared to have full cane, and they were all on one accord. That means on one accord, that means everybody got come as one. That means like you can't have like half of the family be, you no, know, trying to get together, and the other one turn you down. Y'all, if y'all in Christ, y'all got to come as one. Thank you, thank you, the Holy Ghost. Oh, Jesus. So God say that why God say um, trust your brother. Do not judge your brother. If you uh, speak a bad word towards your brother or your enemy, go to, before you go to them, ask the Lord to forgive you. Then go find the person and ask them to forgive you. Because if you don't, y'all will be danger of uh, hell fire. Because y'all are talking about your brother. So if don't say a bad thing about your brother or nothing. Like my mother always said, if you can't say nothing good about your brother in church, don't say nothing at all. Cause uh, y'all tongue is a dangerous weapon again. So y'all can't say nothing good about your brother or your sister in Christ. Don't keep you just keep your hand off them. Cause uh, y'all is touching God anointed people. That all that brother Thomas got to say by the pond. Y'all have a blessed day, and I will see y'all next time. Me and brother Joe do another video at the pond by God word. Amen. And again. Another beautiful day that the Lord had made. Look at this creation, y'all. You can see the clouds in the water. We just gonna take a moment and just think and look at God's creation. What God can do, how wonderful and merciful and graceful and favorable he are. Look at the creation, y'all.